In order to make a denture, there's a lot of steps involved. It's kind of like baking a cake. So I love sweets, I love to cook on the weekends. And so you have to gather all your ingredients in order to make a cake. And you know, each layer of cake builds on the previous layer and dentures are made in a similar fashion. So the difference between our office and another office is we're able to custom tailor or customize uh, a patient set of dentures in our own office. So the patient is uh, heavily involved in the tooth selection, which we offer some of the highest grade and highest quality teeth available. But also our technician is able to interact with the patients and he's able to see his artwork actually live in the patient. So if we have uh, some subtle changes or characterizations or requests from the patient, we don't have to wait weeks and weeks to send the case back to the laboratory like most general dentists do. My technician and I can communicate uh, the changes or uh, the improvements uh, that the patients request and those are made real time. They're made immediately, the patient doesn't have to wait and uh, the patient uh, can preview those changes before the denture is processed. And the way that the denture is processed varies from laboratory to laboratory. We use some of the highest uh, standards and highest quality techniques available. Uh, the dentures are uh, first made into wax and, and we use a beeswax that allows the patient to preview things and we can move things in the wax. But once the patient uh, likes the, the setup, we're able to process, I call it cook. Again, going back to the cooking reference, we, we, we process the dentures. The technician is able to uh, finish them and polish them and create uh, little subtle uh, details that allow them to be lifelike and fit very good as well. In the end, the patient's able to chew better, uh, their confidence is much higher, uh, they feel great, and uh, a lot of our patients are very, very happy.